whole scene and then she realizes her kid is watching and has seen her kiss the other woman. Um, I think we did try cuts of the film where you knew the boy was there. Uh, and where Stephen, wanted, Stephen Daldry, who was the director, wanted to see what the effect was on the scene if we, the audience, not she, Julianne Moore, knew the boy was watching, but when, when um, if, if we knew the boy was there and what effect it had on the scene. But these kind of things, these, these to me are what the screenwriting... I wouldn't have let a cut of the film go out where the boy wasn't held to the end of the scene. Not under my name. Um, those are the kind of things you start feeling incredibly strongly and powerfully about. I have certain deal breakers on the movie when I write them where I say, we either do that or it's, it's nothing to do with me. Uh, because you begin to develop a very strong sense of what the absolute focal points in a movie are, and the focal point in the movie for me is what happens to the young man because he sees his mother kissing another woman. And so you, the placement of a moment like that is what screenwriting is about. That's what screenwriting is about. It's about um, how do I structure things so that the thing that really matters happens at the moment that I most need it to happen. And, and there is, that's what screenwriting is. The rest of it is easy. The rest of it is easy. But the, the really difficult thing is, is, is placing those moments that spin the film. Um, and the, with that scene, obviously, what you're playing with the audience in the sense that you have two surprises up your sleeve, not one. Uh, in other words, the audience assumes that Julianne Moore kissing um, Tony Collette is the surprise that the screenwriter is springing at the end of the scene. Uh, but in fact, we have another surprise up our sleeves, which is the little boy's been watching all along.